Hey guys, it's Hannah and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a little video um, telling you 10 things that you should know about me. I think like since it's my 11th video, um, it's probably about time that I tell you guys a little bit more about myself um, and yeah, tell you like little details that like you may not know about me. Um, so I'm just gonna get started. So the first thing that you should know about me and this is like what I would always say in class when you know you're going around the room introducing yourselves on the first day and people are like you know what's a fun fact about you I guess the one that I would always say is that I speak three languages so clearly I speak English um, because I grew up in the US but I also speak, speak Spanish because I'm from Mexico City um, and so my parents spoke to me in Spanish and that was actually my first language and finally I actually speak French as well um, I took it kind of like all through middle and high school. I took it a little bit in college. I studied abroad in Paris I met my boyfriend there and so like, you know all of that plus having a French boyfriend I guess you know you have to speak French by that point <laughs> um, So another thing you should know about me is that I love the color pink um, But I actually love colors in general like I love when I'm editing pictures on Photoshop like for a job or like, you know for myself whatever um, And I'm like, you know, you know when you like zoom in on Photoshop and you see like every single picture pixel ugh pixel and how different like all the colors are um, I love that I love to see like the different shades that are interpreted to be black like by my brain or like the different shades that are interpreted to be white and they could actually be like a very light green or something like that um, I really just love like choosing colors I love finding colors um, I don't know I don't, I don't know why it's just, like weird so I might have mentioned this before maybe in the video where I was unboxing the stills um, photos but um, I this is my third one. I seriously love Kanye West. Um, I don't know why. Like, oh, I do know why. But like, I've, I have like a major obsession with him. I just like love the way he thinks. And um, if you want to know more about it, because I know that like he's a little bit controversial. But if you want to know more about why I like Kanye West so much, um, I can definitely do a video about that, or I can include it in like a Q and A video. So number four, um, I'm one of four kids. Uh, I guess this is fitting to be number four, but yeah, um, so I'm the second child. I have an older brother who is uh, 23. I have a younger brother who's 17 and I have a little sister who is 16. All of whom are my favorite people on this earth. <laughs> okay, so number five, um, I'm a serious phone game addict. Anytime I find a new game, I could literally spend like days on the couch just playing that game like it's actually savage right now I'm kind of in the middle of like three different games that I think are really good one of them is called two dots you guys have pro like that's a pretty common game but my other two are like a little more elusive then the other one is called cross me and you like do little puzzles it's kind of like sudoku but not really it's like with it's like a picture puzzle with numbers it's kind of complicated to explain but like if you play the first level you'll understand what I mean um, but yeah, Cross Me is really good. And then my other third game that I'm into right now is called I Love Hugh. I saw somebody playing it on a plane and I like really had to ask about it because it looked so fun. It's like this game where you basically like unscramble colors. I know it sounds like so boring, but whatever. You like unscramble colors and like you have to try to make it like look like as satisfying as possible. Like there is a right answer. It's just like kind of hard to like explain <laughs> so the next thing about me you should know is that I drink iced coffee every single day like mostly every single day um, even in the winter so I never really drink hot coffee it's just not my thing I like I actually love iced coffee and it's kind of annoying because you know in Europe they don't like serve you iced coffee so much so I don't really like Starbucks but I guess I have to go to Starbucks when I'm in Europe because there's not really any other options for iced coffee but usually I make it like with an espresso machine I just like put ice and do like an espresso in there add some oat milk good to go okay this one's also kind of weird but like my friends who know me will like totally be like yeah that's so true that I am so serious about the pens that I use like when I was probably 16 my mom came back from Paris and brought me some pens from Muji and pretty much ever since then I've only been using Muji pens I can't find any that like are as good for me um, so my favorite Muji pen is very specific, but I use the 0.38 millimeter with um, the color blue black, which is kind of like this really amazing navy color that's not really like bright blue or like, you know, dark black. It's like kind of right in between and I love it. I use it for everything. I've been using that color since 
probably the first day of college yeah okay number eight i am the actual worst at texting like so bad I i'll just like see a message pop on my screen and be like okay yeah i'll respond later and then just like forget so i'm not the kind of person who opens and read messages and doesn't answer i know if i read a message i have to answer at that point but if not if i like haven't like opened the message into the app or whatever then uh yeah you probably won't get a response from me from me for like two or three days i know it's really awful like even sometimes like I, I've had my friends like be contacting me and being like, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Because I didn't answer their text. Like, are you okay? Like, are you alive? And I'm like, oh yeah, sorry. Like, I just, I just don't answer. But yeah, sorry to my friends. Um, sorry whoever suffers with that. But yeah, I'm really not good at texting. But honestly, I think it's better. Like, I rather like I know that if somebody's gonna call me, no, if somebody needs to contact me, they're gonna call me. So it's like if it's not an emergency, then I can answer later, and I don't need to be like glued to my phone all day. You know, my boyfriend will say that's not true though. He says that I'm on my phone way too much, but I don't think so. <laughs> Number nine, um, I might have mentioned this before, but I love all my vintage clothes so much more than anything new that I've ever bought. For me, there's just something special about owning something that had a previous life, especially when it's like a really interesting piece, you know, and I just love that the fact that like, well, I love that moment when you go into a vintage store and you see something you love and then you try it on and then it's exactly your size. I literally think that like those pieces come and find you, like you don't find them. So I don't know, I think there's something really special about vintage clothing. I know a lot of people aren't like so into it because you're wearing like clothes that other people have worn before. I don't care like for me I mean either way it's like really good for the environment to shop vintage so guys shop vintage you know you'll find some great stuff I promise you it's hard and vintage stores don't really smell good but aside from that it's pretty chill okay so my number 10 is well I'm sure that a lot of you guys know that like I'm a serious foodie and I have like Hannah Eats even though I don't use Hannah Eats that much I post on there like every once in a while but um, I'm still very serious about the food thing and like people you know still ask me for recommendations all the time but I will say that I don't think that I could ever choose a favorite food. Um, I think it would be super difficult for me to do that just because there's so many cuisines that I like so much. I love Mexican food, I love Italian food, I love Lebanese food, I love French food. I love, well, actually, I don't love French food. I love certain French dishes, but I'm, in general, I'm not like a huge fan of the French cuisine. Sorry, France. Um, but there's really good food in Paris, so whatever. But um, I love like sushi, I love, so it's like, I guess within each category, I could definitely pick one thing that's like my favorite, but I don't think that I could pick, oh my God, it's getting dark, sorry. I don't think that I could pick like just one favorite food. Yeah, if that makes sense. But if I had to pick a favorite thing to drink, my favorite thing to drink is probably red wine. Yeah. Okay, so this has been my video explaining a little bit more about myself, telling you 10 fun facts that you should know about me. Um, if you guys have any questions on these, I'm definitely thinking of doing a Q&A very soon. So if you want to participate in the Q&A, you could leave some questions below or you could um, like follow me on Instagram um, and you know just wait until I post like the Q&A like little stories um, so yeah so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and getting to know me a little bit better um, I'm sure that you know I mean in my last videos I've been really just like talking about products and outfits and like restaurants and stuff but um, I definitely think it's important that you guys get to know me a little better um, so yeah I hope that you guys really enjoyed this please give it a thumbs up bleh. please give it a thumb <laughs> I still can't say it please give it a thumbs up if you did um, and yeah please don't forget to subscribe